One of the biggest problems in microfluidics is the presence of bubbles, as they may destabilize the flow and affect the readings from the sensors. They are also capable of damaging cells due to sheer stress and several other situations. To assemble the debubbler, place a filter between the two parts of the housing of the unit and screw them together with the help of an Allen key. It is now recommended to screw the housing too tight since it may deform the filter and cause leakage. Place the tubing that will function as the input and output of the bubble remover. The input tubing will go to the reservoir that holds the sample we wish to run through the micro device. The output tubing should be connected to the input of the micro device, where the sample will flow without any bubbles. Finally, connect the pressure or vacuum pipe to the adapter and couple the other end of the pipe to the flow control unit. 